Oh, I just love you so much, Sega. You're you're just my you're my only friend. I I oh oh. Uh. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> hey guys and gals, I didn't know that you were there. It's Caleb here, and uh, we're gonna talk about something that you'd normally not expect from a guy like me. You know, you never hear me uh, complain about games not being good, right? I don't I don't ever do that. Well, don't I have a treat for you today, guys? Girls, kids, whatever. Hi. <sighs> Today we're going to play three bad side-scrollers for Sega Genesis. All three of these games suck, and it was painful to even play them, to even show you these games. So some of what I want to do is help people avoid playing bad games. So I'm going to show you my trials and tribulations with some bad games. So here is three bad side-scrollers for Sega Genesis. Check it out. Stormlord has an early Master System quality vibe to it. Overly simplistic graphics that are both charming at first glance and completely mundane after seconds. There's seriously minimal animation to the sprite in this game. Your character moves with all the charm and personality of a desktop icon. The way it looks may slightly remind you of games like Ghosts and Goblins, but don't fool yourself, it's total garbage. Trying to figure out the levels is tedious and a complete chore, offering nothing but shallow payoff. It took me forever to realize I had to jump over this voluptuous fairy half naked sticking out of a pot here. Like the whistle? It's so easy to die in this game. Oh, what is this, some kind of bird? We got birds now, bird power. Whee! So yeah, Storm Lord's just not really a good game. I mean, it looks kind of cool in a way, and the music's really kind of neat, but it's repetitive after a while, and the gameplay is just not that fun. I mean, I know it looks kind of charming, but trust me, this game sucks. The controls are terrible in this game, and the animation is terrible, and level design doesn't really get much more interesting. This game sucks. Just don't even, don't even play this game. I mean, what are these things flying around? What is this? What am I looking at in this game? Like, what's that mountain in the background? Is it floating in darkness? Is it just a peak? Is this some kind of abstract art? I and mean, the lightning looks kind of neat when it happens. You have to, like, replace items with items in your inventory. It's just really stupid. I don't like it. I don't like this game. No. No, Stormlord. No. The Sword of Sedan. A sedan? Like a car that you drive? No. But yeah, that girl's face looks nice. Enterprise? These people can't even spell. I'm not really expecting a lot out of this, but I mean, I'm sure it's better than the last game, right? So yeah, I'm gonna pick uh, the greased up guy or the girl. I'm gonna get the girl and at the city's gate, as so foretold. Okay, this map really doesn't make sense to me now, so forget about that. Whoa, 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 what? This is what the game looks like? Oh my god, why do I move like that? Is that is that really the way that you walk? You just kind of inch forward? Oh, oh god, this collision detection is so terrible. The way that it feels, like when you actually attack the enemies, it's just so bad. I'm just really whacking away at them. You can kind of like press your, your controller directional button down and crouch and attack, and it's just not even better. It's like, poke it on the stomach, get it, yeah. No, this game is, oh my god, look at it. Look at this game. You have to like go between these little potions that you don't even know what they do. You just pick up these potions and you know, press start and you can go between them and it just pauses the game. Kind of adds like agility and speed and strength. It's it's terrible. I mean, this game is terrible. Maybe it looked good on paper, but this does not look good. You select them all and they're highlighted and okay, I guess I'll drink all of them just to see what the hell happens. No, you just drink, I guess, one of them and nothing happens. No effect, man. That's stupid. I wanted to die right there. I really did. I wanted to hear that death scream. It's overly compressed vocals. Look at those crickets chirping. Is that the music in this game? Just environmental sounds? This game is lazy as crap. This is a terrible, terrible port of a game. I don't think the original is that much better personally, but my god, this game sucks. If you don't think this game sucks, I'm sorry. I mean, just look at it, listen to it. Try to play yourself. See how far you can get. This game is impossible. The controls are terrible. The animation is terrible. The music, there isn't really any, is terrible. Oh my god. Did I mention the graphics are terrible? The graphics are terrible. This game is butt salad. Hulk smash. U.S. gold. Hulk smash. Pro. Hulk smash. Your dreams about this game actually being good. But holy moly, that's a fly-ass title screen. Okay, so the uh, comic cutscenes look pretty cool. This is promising. Okay, this is not the Hulk. I mean, this may be like Lou Ferrigno Hulk, because this guy looks a little too short. I mean, when I think of the Hulk, he's like nine foot tall. What is this crap? Trolls just seem really weird. Like, you can grab your enemy, it doesn't really work all the time. All you can do is punch them. These don't seem like Hulk moves. The graphics really aren't that bad in this game. They don't really bother me. I and mean, they're pretty detailed, actually. Pretty decent sprites. But the uh, Hulk is way too small. I mean, he should be much bigger than that. These robots must be huge. So yeah, just walking around as the Hulk, you know, just doing Hulk things, just going up and down ladders. Like, they made ladders that the Hulk could fit on. That's, that's 
That's not how the Hulk is. Hulk is way bigger than this. He just smashes his way. We can pick up this freaking stupid thing after I fight these. Oh god. Actually, turning into Bruce Banner in this game really sucks. He just get executed immediately. This game's not very fun to play. It's very boring. This is a boring game. Uh, the clouds look really cool as they're going by, and the music's pretty awesome in this game, but it's just not a fun game to play. I'm sorry. Like, what a miss. The Incredible Hulk is such a cool character, and there's been really good games like Hulk's Ultimate Destruction for Xbox. That's a good Hulk game. I mean, why am I picking up pills as the Hulk? Why would the Hulk pick up pills? He doesn't take pills. He's not taking drugs. He's radioactive. Headbutting robots. Nimrod looking robots. <laughs> this game sucks. I mean, it's probably out of the list of these three games. This is probably the best game on my list, and that's really sad. Let's stay away from this game. It's also a turd. Thanks for watching Game Glip and don't forget to subscribe.